Hello Phantom fans, Voice of the Phantoms, Matt Lipsack here with you. Welcome into Season 2, Episode Number 1 of Ghost Stories. Hockey people on the computer getting coffee. The name has been retired. I don't know if we'll see it up in the rafters at the Cavelli Center or not. But regardless, hope you like the new name and we hope you like the show. We plan on having some great guests here for you this season. And we do want to give a big thank you to our friends over at Duncan for sponsoring the show one more time. Well, Father's Day weekend, the Phantoms had training camp down at Princescape Arena in Cannonsburg. I made the drive down from northeastern Ohio to talk with some of the attendees at camp about what they thought about the week-long event and also what they were up to with their summer vacation. Take it away, boys. Forward, Jack Zillage. Jax, how's your camp been so far, bud? Pretty good. Pretty dominant. Getting shots off quick, and I'm ready to go and get ready for the season. We just finished up All-Star Game number one. How did uh, how that go for you? Pretty dominant. Also, I mean, shooting the puck, still making plays, and you know, I feel really good right now. So I'm re I'm still ready to go for the season. Just get it started. <laughs> what uh, what have you been up to since April when the season ended? You know, just a lot of. I'm at, I'm at my lake house in Wisconsin. A lot of wake surfing, a lot of fishing, all that. Working out, boxing, and uh, skating a lot. So. All right, awesome, man. So uh, what are you go going to be up to for the rest of the summer until we see you again in September? All the same stuff, you know, just surfing, boxing, lifting, skating, all that. So, All right, Jack, you enjoy the rest of your summer, bud. We'll see you in, in September in Youngstown. You too, Lipper. Thank you. Jaden Grant, forward. How's your camp been, bud? It's been a good week. It's been fun getting back to the competitive environment and fun seeing a lot of new faces around. What have, uh, what have you been up to since the season let out back in April? Uh, kind of took two weeks off the start and then slowly started getting into working out and then uh, started skating the last few weeks here to get ready for camp. What uh, what are you going to be working on for the rest of the summer? How are you going to stay in shape for September when a uh, big camp rolls around? Uh, I've been working with my trainers back at home, working with the coaching staff here and at Bowling Green to get me ready, uh, working on a lot of skill stuff around uh, off the ice and on the ice as well. So. Uh, from the help of the staff, so get ready for the season. All right, Jane, enjoy the rest of camp. We'll see you in September. Perfect, thank you. Forward, Jack Larrigan. Jack, how was your camp? Uh, you know, so far it's been pretty good. Uh, just getting to see the boys again and, um, you know, getting out there on the ice again with the boys. It's been great. Um, we have one more tomorrow, so we're going to get that done. We just wrapped up All-Star Game number one. How did it go for you? Uh, it was good. It's definitely a faster pace than um, the games before. Um, you know, I had a lot of fun out there with my teammates. Um, good to be around my buddies again, so yeah, it went pretty well. Uh, what have you been up to since the season let go back in April? Yeah, so, you know, i just been home, working out, um, skating every day, pretty much. Um, you know, just having fun with friends, just, you know, spending time with family, it's just been fun. I know you told me you've got a busy schedule after this camp lets out. What can you tell us about the rest of your summer? Yeah, so um, I'm heading to uh, Buffalo, New York for uh, the National Camp for USA Hockey on Wednesday. And, um, you know, other than that, uh, you know, I'm just going to be chilling at home, um, get ready to uh, get, go back to Youngstown in uh, uh, August. All right, Jack, good luck the rest of the summer. Hope you make the, uh, the national team to head over to Europe, and we'll see you back in uh, August or September in Youngstown. Yep, thanks, Lip. Quinn Kennedy, Miles Gunny. Guys, how's camp been going? Uh, Quinn, we'll start with you. Uh, it's been going good. There's a lot of a lot of good guys here. It's been fast and it's, it's been fun. Miles, how about you? Yeah, it's been it's been awesome. I've been fortunate enough to play with him, so we have a little chemistry going every game, and uh, yeah, it's been good. So both of you guys got to play a couple of games in the USHL the past couple of years. Uh, how does it compare to things down in the uh, the NA and uh, the E? Uh, it's definitely it's definitely a little higher higher pace, but it's it, they're all good hockey, so it's a lot of fun. Yeah, um, just like he said, it's it's. I mean, both leagues are extremely high pace, um, high quality guys. I think that just. I mean, there's obviously a couple NHL draft picks on each USHL team, so it's it's a little bit faster, a little bit quicker. You gotta know what you're gonna do with the puck before you get it. And I mean, it's it's really good hockey either way. Any uh, any plans for the the rest of the summer? How are we gonna stay in shape for for camp come September? I think we're just gonna go home and train uh, in the gym and on the ice with uh, some of our coaches back home, some of our buddies. Yeah, same as him. Just skate, hopefully, at, uh, at our local rinks and get in the gym as much as possible. All right, guys, thanks for uh, for taking the time, and we will see you out on the ice. Thank you. Thank you. All right. Defenseman Mike Brown. Mike, how's your camp going, bud? Camp's been going well. Uh, I feel great out there, confident, skating with the puck a little more. Uh, I feel great. Uh, we just wrapped up All-Star Game number one. How would you uh, rate your performance? 
a uh, little slow in the start, but I got the legs going. Um, it's great competition out here. Uh, I can't wait to see uh, how the team unfolds uh, in the future. What have you been up to since uh, season let go back in April? I uh, just been working out, skating. Uh, I've been with former Phantoms or current Phantom Fury, Kyle Fury and uh, Riley Duran. We've been working out together, so spending a lot of time. It's a blast. Enjoying summer. Checking out the Bruins and the Red Sox. Here and there, tough loss for the Bees. I was upset about it, but the Sox are up on top. What are you up to for the rest of the summer till we see you again in September? Same old, working out and skating, just getting ready for the season. All right, Mike, well, you take it easy. We'll see you then, brother. Thank you. Defenseman, Kyle Fury. Kyle, how's your camp been so far? Doing good. It, um, good start, or more than a start to the weekend. So uh, now that we're in the All-Star Games, it's good competition. The pace is picking up and the hits are picking up too. So it's, um, it's fun hockey. It's great to see the guys and uh, it's good to be here. Speaking of the All-Star Games, we just wrapped up All-Star Game number one. How did it go for you? It went well. It was um, scoreboard not so great, but um, I think we'll bounce back tomorrow as a team. I think we got a lot of depth and some good skill, so uh, hoping for a better result tomorrow. What have you been up to since the season ended back in April? A lot of golf. A lot of golf. Uh, hanging out with some buddies I haven't seen in a while, so it's it's been great to get home, see some old friends, and uh, relax for for a little before the season gets back and rolling. Brownie said you guys were agonizing over the bees. Are you doing okay? I'm gonna make it. I'm gonna be okay. It was a tough loss. I thought we had a I thought we had a great team this year, and uh, Islanders just kind of took it to us. What uh What are your plans for the rest of the summer after camp? Let's go. Uh, same old working out, skating, getting ready for the season, and uh, trying to have a little fun too. So. Uh, All right, Fury. We'll see you in September, bud. Sounds good. Defenseman Byard Hall. Byard, how's camp going for you, bud? Camp's been going awesome, you know, I mean, it's great to see a lot of the boys, great to get back out on the ice, you know, being out here, not quite in Youngstown, but it's pretty close, so I'm uh, definitely excited about that, but, you know, overall, it's been a really fun week, and, uh, you know, just great to kind of be back and see everyone. We just finished up All-Star Game number one. You had a beauty of a goal. T take us through that. Yeah, you know, I mean, I just kind of uh, made a nice little breakout pass and then jumped in the play, and I got an awesome feed. Um, you know, shout out to my teammate for feeding me, you know, it was kind of all him and then just did a little finish in front, hit the backhand and, uh, you know, it was great. You know, I mean, there's a lot of energy going and uh, I think we had just scored the uh, shift before. So, um, you know, great to add to that and, uh, you know, just, you know, fun to score and fun to be a part of it. What have you been up to since the season ended back in April? Uh, I've been, uh, you know, taking a little time off. You know, I've been working on a farm, which has been awesome. Definitely been skating and working out these past couple weeks. Uh, you know, just enjoying being home with the family. And, you know, great state in New Jersey, very underrated state. But, uh, no, it's, it's definitely been nice uh, getting to be home for a little bit. But, you know, definitely getting ready for next season and gearing up for that. Any plans for the rest of the summer after camp? Let's go. Yeah, I mean, just kind of working out and skating and, uh, you know, hanging out with some buddies and enjoying some time with my family and being home. Uh, you know, just kind of really looking forward to next year and uh, just definitely getting ready for that. All right, Halsey, we'll see you in Youngstown September. Awesome. Thanks, Lipper. That will do it for Season 2, Episode 1 of Ghost Stories. want to thank our friends at Duncan one more time. So, stay tuned for the next episode. Again, we plan on having some great guests for you on the show this season. I'm Voice of the Phantoms, Matt Lipsack. Thanks for tuning in, everybody. Sound out. Ghost Stories.